Hi guys, it's Candace. Hey, welcome back. So I just thought we would take some index cards, <laughs> some of these inks that we have laying around that, you know, still here. <laughs> Stamps that are still laying around on the desk and just kind of, I call it angry stamping, but just, I don't know, do some stamping. I know you don't need this phone, but I wanted to try something else. But so, I know, all, all I'm going to do is take my little index cards. Like I said, they're four by six. And I don't know how this is going to work because it's got lumpy bumps, but we're going to find out. I'm just going to put them together in case we run some of our stamps together. All right. So, I don't know. I just... You know, the other day when I just, I don't know, I just wanted to come play and didn't want to have to think too much. So, I call it angry stamping. It's just finding some junk and, and slapping it on your thing. I'm trying to find a stamp for this one, even though I don't have one for the other one. Ugh. You know, you don't need stamp blocks, but they're hanging out here, so why not? Oh, this needs a little... I was going to say a little toothpaste. Oh, where'd I put it? See, I put that stink of chapstick somewhere where I wouldn't lose it. And by God, if I didn't lose it already. Oh, well, I'm going to lick this one. I can't believe. Oh, there he is. I mean, I put it in a, a place where I was would not lose it, but I did. So, well, this one probably doesn't need it, but I'm just going to put a little bit on the back. All right, he'll stay on there. Oh, anyway, I might have to put a little a name on my thing that says chapstick in here because I can't remember. All right, so let me see. Oh, let's, 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 you know, and usually I do these when I'm stamping off on stuff. That's how I get my other little cards, but we're just going to stamp on here. Um, regular, straight onto it. So, oh, I guess I need to... It doesn't matter, but I guess it would help, be helpful if I put my, my my letters and words the right way, huh? So we're just going to stamp them. And then just whatever, you know, stamp them off just to have some other faint, faint stuff on here. I, I know there's really no rhyme or reason. It's just putting them on some blocks. Finding some stamps. Oh, that's the wrong side. It has the ridges in it. You know, we're not doing a Ruffles commercial. <laughs> Ruffles have ridges. Um, let's see. What do I want to do? Let's do some coffee. Oops. This is just a, I don't know. I don't know where it came from. It's in my journal stamp box. Here, we'll put this down here. It looks looks like it might go in that empty spot. Woohoo! Ooh, that's a little dark. Well, woohoo! It's a little dark. And heck, we'll just stick this one on this side since, oh gosh, you saw me, I wiggled, but well, it doesn't really matter. And then we'll just take and like put a little little here and little there because like I said we're just stamping trying you know making something pretty out of here then we've got this one a little London stamp he looks good let's do him in some I don't know let's do him in some green this is fern green We'll just put some down there, stamp off, and put him here. And then, like I said, you can always just, you know, we're just stamping off, and whatever we come up with, that's what we get. I mean, that's what it's called. What you get. <laughs> um... <clears throat> He needs 
Where's this other one? I know I got other stamps, but well, well, we could put our splat on here. Let's do our splat. I know he's not even out of the. Oh come on! I know I got to put it in in its regular a regular little envelope thingy that I put them in. Let's do our big splat, which means I need. I know. I think I'm down to my last. Let's see what we're going to get. We don't know. We might not like it, but well, like I said, it's just part of angry stamping. You just, oh, wow, look at that. Just splot it on there and see what you get. Sometimes you like it. Sometimes you don't. Sometimes you feel like a nut. Sometimes you don't. <laughs> anyway. Okay, so we got that. Now, see, I need something on this side and something over there. We'll just st stick you over there. Let me, let me look in here. Oh, I have this. Our little swishy thing, swirly. So let's, I don't know, should we put another color on here or should we just stick with... Let's introduce some Victorian velvet. Why not? Let's see what it looks like. Not so bad. Okay. And still room for like if you want to put a label or even a flower or, you know, whatever. I mean, that gives me like three things. And let's just come across here. And then we'll come across over here, too, at an angle. I don't know. I mean, you know, see, when you separate it, it's totally different. And then, let's see. Boom, boom, boom. Let's do some splats. Well, you know, it would help if I had a whole piece of paper, but, well, we'll just do two shorties. <laughs> and let's just throw, I don't know, some tea. I know. And y'all are like, can't you use some other colors? Well, this is what I have on the desk. We're playing with what's on the desk. Because <laughs> I'm too lazy to pick it up. Oops. And this just has like a gold shimmer. It's called tea, but it's it's kind of bronzy. When it dries, it's got a gold shimmer to it. So it's it's really interesting. And then I know let's put a little of this on here. Our little crack pistachio. Just you know, so in case we needed some other color throughout. I know I'm decorating my my, my paper behind here more than I am my but you know that way it just helps you be able to pull it into other things that might not necessarily have that color in it but you know put little splats on there and voila we have our little just you know, like I said, I call it angry stamping, but it's just throwing some stuff down and you get a really pretty little card. So let me put this aside so we can dry. Well, uh-oh. Let me find a spot. And then here's this one. I know, and then when we ink around it, it'll be pretty. But there's that. Okay, so now... I know, see, and then I'm not going to, oh, look, it's bleeding through the back. That's going to be interesting. So, <laughs> all right, let's grab us two more. Now, my question was, can you, and I don't know, but we're getting ready to find out. Oh, I have a headache. This weather here is, the, my sinuses are just killing me. 
Okay. I'm going to lose that, but let me see it over here. I have these med me hello, medicine lids, and they're raised on top. So I wanted to know, can you, oh, I think so, can you turn them into stamps? Well, I think, I think you can. I mean, it's backwards, but I mean, hello, it's mixed media junk, and I mean, just playing with some stuff at the house. So that worked. And then I have this big one. That came from, I don't even know, a big pill. Oh, don't know about that. We'll see, because it's not picking up on the inside. But, I mean, if you're looking for some, some grunginess, I think this would be pretty cool. If you're just wanting some... You know, circle stuff that's not what you what you normally have, and just something different outside the box. Okay, so well, I would say that was was okay, pretty cool. I say so. So it's not a winner winner chicken dinner, but you know, not so bad. So yes, you can use medicine bottles as a grunge effect for stamping so all right now next let's see what do we have oh, we got black on there so let's do some of this script it's still ovally so let's go with some sepia. I know I've just got I've got all these little inks off of my thing, but I mean we're just playing. We're seeing what we come up with. I mean that's just the whole thing. Stamp and see. <laughs> oh alright. So now this could be a this away because we just gotta stamp it off. And then, let's see if we can get just a little bit more. Ho, 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 with a little elbow grease. Um, nope. But hey, I tried. I gave it a valiant effort. <laughs> All right, so now, let me see. What else can we stick on here? Whew, it's warm down here. We have our little London thing again. So let's... Take our little swirly off, put our London on, and let's do London in coffee. Ooh, that's dark. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can just lightly hit it one more time. All right, now I need to get some off of it. So we're just going to go down here and like that. Okay. Anyhow, let's see. All right, we're done with that one. Okay, we could use some fern green. Ferny, ferny, fern, fern. Let's do fern green and some splots. Let's see what that looks like. Ooh, pretty. <laughs> I should say so myself. I like it this way, though. I mean, you know, this you just miss your mouth altogether. Okay, I'm going to have to tell you. I'm going to have to tell on myself. So the other night, I don't know what night it was. I'm so lost on my days with everything, y'all. Um, I was hungry, but I was sleepy, but I was more hungry than sleepy. So I made a bowl of cereal and I thought I was awake, you know, could be awake long enough to eat it. Well, apparently I wasn't. 
and I nodded off. Okay, I, I slept, fell asleep in my chair. And I was watching, Family Feud was on, and you know, you see I can make it through one whole little 30 minutes of Family Feud, but nope, not today. So I woke up, because I was like, man, I feel wet. Well, I had set my bowl of cereal on my chest, I guess I'll tell. Um, they're not. It's not that big, but I can still rest them when I'm sitting in the chair. And it had tilted, and the milk had run out, and my whole top pajamas were soaking wet. I was like, "It's time to go to bed." So, yeah, I <laughs> dusted myself off, <laughs> changed my shirt, wiped my chest, and I went to bed because apparently I needed to go to bed. So there, there. Now I just told on myself. It was a little, it was apparently a rough, <laughs> rough evening. Oh, but yeah, I mean, good gosh. So, it was definitely time, you know, to go to bed when, when you wake up with your chest full of wetness. So yeah, so that was my funny, funny, ha ha Candace. I know, that might just be too much pink there, but well, I stuck it on there. So now, what does he need? Something right there. That That's naked. Naked, naked. How about some stormy sky? Yes, I do have other color inks, but they're over on the other side. And like I said, this is play with what's on my desk. Oh, that's pretty. <laughs> Put some up here in this circle. And I don't know. Let's put put one right here and one over there. And I know he needs something up there, but well, there you go. I'm stamping off onto my own paper. So all right, now, let's see. I have these stencils here that was left over from the other day. Do we want dots? Nope. Let's see what else is on here. Oh, yeah, let's grab these off of here. Oh, I didn't see. I didn't even close it from the other day. How this just does not fall over the, all over the place is a thankful miracle because pff, it twas been a mess if it would have been so let's let's just excuse me as I reach get our little vintage I, see got a big old mess going on over here but we need some something behind there just a little bit, see? Just a little bit, I know. And then let's put some, let's put some pluses on there. And then we'll put some pluses down here. Yeah, I told John, it, obviously it must have been the night before John came home, because I told him what happened. He's like, oh my gosh, I'm like, I know, I said it was so sad. <laughs> Can't believe I did it, <laughs> getting too old. But, yeah, yeah, see, I don't know, I should have maybe walked away from, from those, but oh well, we'll splatter it. See if it helps. Oh, this is my regular. I don't want to put it up because I'll never find it and then I'll be freaking out. <laughs> Y'all will be like, oh, you put it up on the shelf, woman. Okay, what other colors are back here in my little shelf? We got rich mocha. I don't know. Let's see what cocoa, whatever. Oh. Well, that that is definitely darker. All right, and then we're just gonna have to, you know, 
stamp it off. Okay. Well, I rich cocoa'd it. Let me put that back in the thing. All right, and then I guess we want to go ahead and um, put some splats on it so it ties into our, our other things. In case we want to, you know, use it in the same journal, but have something just a little bit different. All right. So, now, get back here. Well, can I, can I, can I? You know, I'm looking at this little bee, and I'm gonna. We're going to put the bee up here. So, I'm going to take some some tape and just mask off where I don't want my ink to get and oops I got a block down here so I can't there we go oh how cute I know and then let me just wipe this tape off so I don't get oh see there was some there obviously I got too much. I got ahead of myself, but you can't tell it blends in when blends in because you know mixed media, baby. B B B. See, I should have put the B up a little more, but oh well. I was ruining my mouth. Now I'm wondering. Well, no, let's not. I know I wanted to put that up there. But no, I'm not. I'm not. I'm talking myself out of it. Okay, so now we're going to splat for sure this time. Same thing. A little bronzy tea. You know, I don't know why I'm so afraid of ever playing and doing these things. But anyway... And then a little bit of our cracked pistachio. Just put a little more of that green in there. Whoops, that was a big blob. Oh well. Oh, these are cute though. I like them. Alright, so let's look at this one. I'm gonna sit aside, let it dry. So there, see? We made we made four of them in 30 minutes. Well 33. And that one. Doo -doo -doo -doo. And they're gonna look cute when we ink around them. Okay, so let me set that aside. I'm running out of sides. <laughs> I think I told you that a minute ago. All right, so now I got my shoes off. My feet are cold on concrete. <clears throat> okay, so we have. Oh dear lord! <clears throat> Let's see. If I have, you know, this girl. She would be some kind of sunflower bee-ish. Not, not bee-ish. <laughs> bee-ish. <laughs> I, I might run over because I'm going to do this one. All right, so if I put this on here, I want to do that one first and then make a little mask. So let's take this one off. I'm going to put her on here because she looks like she's an artist and she's out in the field drawing bees and all that good stuff. So, all right. So let's put her down. I know, I've got to make sure. Yeah, I still, I want to go there. Okay. 
how I did it. Okay, there she is. Now I need to do a stamp on the side because I want to put this on here. So it looks like there. Oh, well, I, f I faintly can see that, but we're going to see if we can cut it out. I know I gotta angle it. I think I'm cutting her arm off. Mm. Well, you know, I might have to put a little more ink on her because I can't see what I'm doing. All right, much better. Oops, well, not really because now I didn't cut. Well, anyway. See what I did. And I'm hoping I'm not going to cut all my uh, sticky off. I know that flower is going to come around her arm. All right. Put our sunflower and bee on there. Okay, we got that now. Do I want to? Okay. Need some scrap. And I think I'm going to try to come in here and pull. A little more flour into it. This one. All right. Here, we're just going to stamp it off on here because, you know, that's the whole name of the game. Stamp off. I know, and then the stamp off just leads to more and more and more and more. But, well, that is what we do. Crafty, crafty. Okay, so we have that. I know my little bee is down here, which I don't like, but do I want to do that again? Okay, answer is no. All right, so let's. I know I'm wondering, should I just do it all in black? Nope. Let's do. <laughs> Where'd it go? Oh gosh. Oh, it fell. That's why I can't find it. <laughs> oh. I know, I know, it's too darn, too dark. Well, crap. Well, like I said, you never know what you're going to get. Sometimes just a mess. And I just lost my, oh my gosh. See, I should have stamped it off that light on here, but I did not. 
Well, now we got to see if we can fix our, our mistake. She just traveled everywhere. And the passport people said they ran out of ink, so just explain to the next next place why. And she was like, okay, no problem. All right, so now let's do our little London. I'm going to do him in blue again. this one yet so let's do do some swirls in the light blue which is tumbled tumble glass let's see if we can tone that down I don't know if it toned it down or ugly it up but well No, this time let's do uh oh we'll do my big splot oh I've lost my big my big splat it's not back there where it belongs oh what Candace oh it's right here let's better do our splot in pink this time See if you if if you don't like it at first, just keep on stamping. <laughs> You'll eventually like it. Oh hush, I know I'm over. Okay, so you know, I think I'm gonna leave that one like that because you know, um I do believe I want some words in the peeled paint back here lightly okay maybe more than lightly all right we're going over here we're venturing I know <laughs> I know I can see some ink on here, so I'm going this way. Because I think I want to watercolor her. I know. Here, we're going to stamp this over here. On my music note. Alright. So we have that. And, I know. And then I guess we're going to splatter it. I know, imagine that, huh? So, they can match and go along with each other. Oops. I need my other piece. All right. So let's put some more of our <laughs> cracked pistachio. I want to call it cappuccino, but. Oops. Got it on her face. Well, I guess we won't be watercoloring her. I don't know. We'll still have to come back and see. You never know what we get. That. 
Let's put some of this white stuff on here. White linen. I don't know why my, oops, why my thing is so bent. Oops. All right, and this one, this one just needs some of that tea. This one might get some too, but I don't know. Yeah. I see it going everywhere, uh, except on the paper. Why? Why do? I, why does it do that? Why can't it go where you where you're flicking? All right, I think we've made enough mess for the day. <laughs> and that's just my anger stamp. And I mean, it's just taking what you have, the inks that's laying around, and just slapping that puppies on there, and just you really get some interesting things that you can play with. I know I've made some interesting mess back here, but well, it wouldn't be a crafting if, if we didn't make a mess, huh? So there's those two. And then let me stack these up and then we'll, oh, I feel, I knew you were in here. I'm like, there's only room for four there and I got five. Okay. So we got those two which I, I really like. And like I said, after they dry, then we'll come back and I'll we'll do a little watercolor on there. But it's got to dry and they won't dry in time for today. So, well, it is what it is. Okay, there's that one. I'm going to try to see if I can get them all in here. There's that one. Then there's these other two that we did. Just stamping on the on index cards so we can make little journal cards. And uh oh, oh come on, oh. They all, everything looks the same back here. And then there's these two. So there you go. We did six in I don't know thirty seven minutes. So. Thanks for watching. Thanks for sharing some of your time with me. I hope you enjoy this. And like I said, just, you know, when you stamp on there, if you're like, oh, I don't know, just stamp some more. Just keep on stamping. And then if you're really not sure, just throw some splatter on there. And then, you know, you end up with a cute little journal card. So I will see y'all on the next video. Uh, lots of kisses, lots of love. And y'all have a great day and a blessed day. And we'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys.